as one who, uh, throughout my career, before I was ever called to ministry, uh, understood the need for the call to social justice. In the primordial words of Audre Lorde, you cannot use the master's tools to dismantle the master's house. What we've come to understand statistically is, and I think all race theorists, critical race theorists, will agree with me, that if you drill down to the foundation of the master's house, you come to understand the rottenness of the boards that keep us together. As a community, we have allowed for too long this notion of law and order as some Americanism that allows us to think we are a part of something just when in fact law and order was designed to keep us intact. The pig laws, we don't have to start with uh, the new Jim Crow. There's nothing new about Jim Crow. What's new is the tool that Jim Crow is being used, <coughs> is using. So when we drill it all the way down to its lowest common denominator, the economics of it all, the capitalism that has been used against us has caused us to divide ourselves from the true facts. And so I stand here against anything that would allow young people to fall into this mantra of keeping them low, keeping them bold, and giving them nowhere to go. I represent a church that is situated in the middle of oppression, in the fifth ward of the District of Columbia. Right now, gentrification is being planned so that three years from now, 500 families will be displaced. If every one of the 13 to 18 year olds in that complex gets an arrest for marijuana, they can hang it up. Because we all know that the first step down the cradle to the prison pipeline is an arrest. And if they are arrested, that becomes the first stigmatization to their onward and upward mobility towards criminalization in a very hard and fast way. So I stand as a policy person realizing that yes, we have things to do in our community to stop even the attraction of drugs. But before we can get there, we have to cut the bleeding. And the bleeding comes from unappreciated impact of all of the kinds of things that are being done to arrest them and take them into a prison system that means them no good. 